Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. In our previous video, we showed you how to use the AWS pricing calculator to estimate the costs of using Amazon EC2 instances. In this video, I'm going to expand on that by demonstrating how to estimate the costs of another popular AWS service, Amazon S3 for object storage. Amazon S3 is one of the most popular and widely used AWS services, providing scalable and durable object storage. Properly budgeting for S3 costs is crucial for managing your overall cloud spending. I'll walk you through the step-by-step -step process of configuring your usage inputs, reviewing the cost estimate, and exploring optimization strategies for S3 and AWS Pricing Calculator. To get started, go to the AWS Pricing Calculator website at calculator.aws. Click Create Estimate. On the Add Service page, choose a region you want to use S3. Then, in the Find Services field, type in S3. You'll see the Amazon S3 panel. Click Configure. On the S3 Create Estimate page, first, give a description for your estimate. Next, select the S3 storage class you plan to use, such as S3 Standard, S3 Intelligent Tiering, S3 Glacier, or S3 Glacier Deep Archive. Different storage classes have varying pricing. In this demo, we will choose S3 Standard, which is the most commonly used S3 storage class. We also want to estimate the data transfer pricing. In the S3 Standard panel, we first enter the storage amount. The unit could be gigabytes per month or terabytes per month. In this demo, we put in 100 gigabytes of data per month. Next, we need to estimate the number of put, copy, post, or list requests you'll be making to S3 per month. The number of requests impacts your S3 request costs. In this demo, we put in 10,000. We also need to estimate the number of get and select requests from S3 per month, such as 10,000 requests. Now, expand Click Calculations. You'll see the estimated S3 standard cost based on your storage and requests inputs. It costs $2.30 for 100 gigabyte storage and about 5 cents for data requests. Finally, we will input the estimated amount of data you'll be transferring in and transferring out of S3 per month. We will see all inbound transfer into AWS has no cost. Outbound transfer via internet costs 9 cents per gigabytes data. Now, you can click the Save and Add Service button. If you don't need to estimate the cost of other services, you can click View Summary button. Here, the pricing calculator will provide you with a summary of the estimated monthly cost and annual cost based on your input. You can export the cost estimate to CSV, PDF, or JSON file format. Or you can share the estimate summary to others via a public link. Once you have the detailed S3 cost estimate, you can start exploring ways to optimize your usage and reduce your overall spending. This might involve using different S3 storage classes that are more cost-effective for your specific data access patterns, minimizing unnecessary data transfers, or implementing lifecycle policies to automatically move data to cheaper storage tiers over time. The AWS Pricing Calculator can help you model the impact of these optimization strategies on your estimated S3 costs, so you can determine the most effective way to reduce your expenses. In this video, I've shown you how to leverage the AWS Pricing Calculator to estimate the costs of using Amazon S3 for your applications and workloads. Properly budgeting for S3 is an essential part of managing your overall AWS spending. The Pricing Calculator is a free, powerful tool that makes this process much easier. For those who want to dive deeper, I've included a link in the video description to the official AWS user guide on creating and configuring an estimate using AWS Pricing Calculator. If you found this video helpful, 
please like and subscribe to my channel for more AWS tutorials. Also, let me know in the comments below what other AWS services you'd like to learn more about. Thanks for watching.